Hi. <laughs> okay. So I'm making this video in something that has just recently happened to me, like five seconds ago. I have this really bad habit of losing stuff. Everything. I lost so many things, and it's just at the most random times, especially when I need them the most. And nine times out of ten, when I actually end up finding it, it is in the most obvious place ever. Like, this one time, I lost my phone. And the entire day, literally the entire day, I had spent sitting in a chair. How the hell did I lose my phone sitting in a chair all day? Turns out, put it in this pocket. There's a pocket. There was a pocket in this chair. Put it in the pocket. Didn't think to look when I was looking all over for it. When I looked inside the chair, around the chair, under the chair. Didn't think to look in this stupid little pocket. So a week later, a week, I went an entire week without using my phone. Ridiculous. A week later, my sister's like, why don't you check the pocket? And I'm like, why would it be in the pocket? That's stupid. Check the pocket. There's my phone. And this isn't something that really happens. This is something that happens a lot. I literally have probably lost something or spent more than 10 minutes looking for something probably every day. Like when I was I was at band camp last week and probably lost some and lost something every day. I mean like I would, I, I normally find it after I've been looking for a little while. But seriously, like I'll be I'll have something I had ha I'd have something at breakfast. And then I come back to get it at, like, after lunch, and it'll be gone. It'll, like, vanish. I have no idea what happens. Like, m most recently, I set my iPod down somewhere, then went to go do my laundry. Cannot find my iPod anywhere. Ah! It's driving me crazy, and it's happening so often. But, like, another example of me finding, of losing stuff and finding them in the most obvious places was I am in English this year, and AP English, which means I have some more reading to do. There's this book, the book I'm reading now is called The Tiger's Wife. And so we bought this book. It's like a $16 book, so it's expensive. I don't spend that much money on books, except for if it's, like, a book I really, really want to read. I really don't want to read this book. This book sucks. I'm only halfway through it, so maybe it'll change, because that life of high changed. And I lost it. And I was like, well, crap, guess I'm not reading that at band camp in my free time. Just found it the other day, in a bag, in the chair that is right across from my front door. It's like, if I really, really need something, it'll be lost. Like, I'll never be able to find it. If I need it. Only if I need it. But if I don't need it, then it'll take me, like, five seconds to find it, and I'll be good. Just, oh. Another classic example of me losing stuff is every year, for the past three years I've been in high school, I've had to get a second ID because I've lost my wallet or my purse or just the actual ID. Because I was stupid and left it out. 90% of the time, I would leave it in my wallet. In the photo ID slot of the wallet in my purse. But one year, I was an idiot. Two of the years, I lost. One year, I lost my purse. Other year, I lost my wallet. And then the other one, I just lost my actual ID. Because I took it out for some stupid reason. Anyway. So every year, for the past three years, I've had to buy a new one. For $5.00. I can go into the office, pay five dollars, get a new ID, and they're like, are you sure we don't want to check for another little while? Because if I lose my ID, I don't look for it, because I don't really care, because I don't use it. 90% of the time, I just have to type in my little number, and I'm good. But, when I have to go get a book from the library for class, I need my ID. So, just so that I could get this one book from the library, the only time I ever used my ID that year. I had to pay five dollars because I lost my ID. Then, guess what, two weeks later, found my purse in my wallet that had my wallet in it, which had my ID in it. This happens 
It's happened every time. I'll find it like a week or two later. And I'll be like, Why? Couldn't I find that two weeks ago when I was paying for crap? And this is never like if I need something, like like I said, I need something, I can never find it. But if I don't need it and I'm just like, oh, I'm just, you know, derping through all my crap. I'm like, oh, okay, look, I'll need that soon. Let me put it in a place where I'll remember it. Never, ever, ever remember where I put it. They're like, oh, I'll just put it on this shelf in my room. And then don't see it. And then I'm like, where is that thing? I thought it was in my room. Nope. I will move stuff. Like, I'll be like, oh, I found this on my floor. I should move it so that I can put it in a different place so that I can find it the next time I need it. Then I'll pick it up, put it on the shelf, and then two weeks later I'll come back and be like, oh, hey, I should move that into a place where I'll see it more often so that if I need it, I'll know it's there. I'll move it to a place that is no different than the other one that is probably 90% of the time worse. And boom. I lost it. And then the only place I remember having it is that first place, that second, not the first place, the second place where I put it and then moved it again. <sighs> so basically, and this is not only with my stuff, it happened with like, my sister's stuff. Like I borrowed her DVDs and like not returned them to her for like months because I'll accidentally lose one of the discs or like lose the entire thing. Like for, I borrowed her Big Bang Theory discs and lost like one of them. She was not a happy camper. Normally, I'm pretty good about it. Normally, if it's not my stuff, I, I try to take more care of, more, like, better care of it and, like, make sure it's all there all the time. But especially if it's my stuff, I'm terrible about losing stuff. Like, I will bring stuff from my house to my grandparents' house. And then half my suitcase will be gone when I come back home because I've lost it. This year from Game Camp, though, I'm pretty sure everything I took that I wanted to bring back, I brought back. I lost my, I had this, um, for my phone, I have this thing where you can plug it into the wall and then it has the USB port. I lost it during Game Camp. Well, it turns out it was just, like, buried in my suitcase. But anyway, me losing things. That's what I've been talking about for eight minutes. Sorry, I just really needed to make this video, this has made me so mad. So now I'm going to go look for my iPod again. Not going to be shocked if I don't find it, because it's dark. I know what you're saying, Becca, just turn the lights on. I wish. My mom's asleep. I can find the button. I need to. I need to remember to put my mouse there. 